Let's go now to the Dorian. Uh, you'll notice that these are all the same chords again, but just starting on a different start point, a different degree, basically. So I started on the second note uh, of the C major scale instead of the first. So I'm starting on D minor, and of course it's D minor 7th, E minor 7th, F major 7th, G dominant 7th, A minor 7th, B flat 5 minor 7th, up to C major 7th, and then an octave above that, D minor 7th, which you started with. So that's what a Dorian mode sounds like harmonically. And I'm, of course, using 7th chords because I think they're more interesting harmonically, that's all. So here's Dorian one more time. So let's take a closer look now at the left hand so you can see how I finger each chord. The Dorian mode. From minor chord to minor. Starting on D minor and going an octave up. Now let's uh, go to the modes in scale form. The Dorian starting on D. Let's take a real close look at the left hand. I want to show you exactly how I approach each mode. We're going to do one mode at a time. Not only will we look at the way I played the scales, uh, single note, the way you just heard the modes. But I'm also going to show you variations, and I'll explain as we go. Let's do the Dorian, first single note, and this one I'm going to do all with slurs first. do just starting with slurs and then striking the strings like this. twos, try to think in groups of two only, like accent basically going one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, so you're accenting the one. Notice the fingering I'm doing.
to, to have a reference point. Let's look at fours now. One, two. 